Yo guys, I'm back again. So basically, uh, today I'm going to be doing a tutorial on how to make a draw beat, uh, draw beat melody, like uh, any sort of dark melody. You can use in other things, but it's usually drill or trap if you push it. it depends how you do it. Um, I'm going to use Nexus, but obviously this is like Nexus paid. So if you don't have, don't want to pay for Nexus, you can use Keyzone. Um, it's also just as good really. I'll use the Yamaha Grand Piano and turn the attack on maybe a little bit, you don't have to, but not too much. So it's really really simple how to make a draw melody. It's like probably one of the easiest melodies to make across genres. Um, so what I'm going to do is show you what effects on it first, because I normally put the effects on first, so if you're an FL obviously you, know, you could do some others if you have the plug in for the FL, this is what I do. So, um, parametric filter 40 hertz to 80 kilohertz, cut to about midpoint. Sometimes you can do it more, but you don't want too much low end because it will clog the airway and kicks. And if you have, gro you will have gross beef you have um, FL, but I have half time. Half time is a lot better than gross beef for half time, but gross beef has a lot more stuff to it. So you want it on a half speed, um, two or four times. I do four for more darker melodies, but if you want a lighter melody, two times is quite good. And for the counter melody, use this, so you can do more step and pianos for the melody. But you don't have to do that, you can do counter melodies with this. So for this I'm going to use four times. And yeah, but if you have gross beat and do a half time, it'll only be one of these. But if you would add another gross beat, then put on half time you'll get the same effect as four times you can't unfortunately change this on gross speed that I know of I don't know if you can change it but I've never done it so I'm not sure so yeah that's it pretty much that's literally all the effects you need on it you might want to gain boost though because sometimes it can be quiet but not really I don't really do that a lot I just turn it up on the mixer if you um, don't know scales for pianos there's a scale kit you can get on it's on reddit if you type in google scale midi file pack it's on a reddit page somewhere i can't remember where it is but if i find it i'll link in the description so it's probably in the description of this video <coughs> so um do you want a harmonic minor or natural minor they're normally the ones to go to um i'm gonna just go with c sharp natural minor drop down there and turn it off so you can't hear it um, what I'll do is I'll do one with Nexus and then copy the same pattern to Keyzone to show you that it's relatively similar other than the presets on Nexus are a lot better but the, the dark melody is still there that you can use so for here I'm going to use the Drill UK, uh, KS Beats UK Drill Kit Nexus preset I'll try and link it in the description if I find it but if I can't just type in YouTube US no, KS UK Drill Kit and it's the necklace presets are in there. So this is what to start off with. I would go with two notes. Do something like this. Don't ever change the root note of a melody. Just change this one to keep that like drill sort of vibe to it. And then we go down. It takes a while to find where you want to like um, go with the melody. Like on me, it like take me like about five, ten minutes to make one. A simple one, a complicated one, may take up to twenty minutes, half an hour. So, Control B to duplicate. Sounds pretty good. Maybe one more down. Yeah, that's perfect. So that's a really good draw melody on there. So then you can just control B to duplicate it to make it a 16 bar loop. And then take your MIDI kit and just 
do that all the way over. So then you can also you can do this. Select all, Control C, Control V to copy and paste. Control up arrow to go up one, and then drag the whole thing back to make sure it's in the same time, like the same. Um, it's all on time. And then you could do like here. For this, actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up a new Nexus and I'm going to go to the same one, but what I'm going to do is turn the attack down so it doesn't fade in. It's more of a straight in your face there. I need to make sure, actually. So, one. Okay, so. This is where I'm actually going to make a new channel, I'm going to make this two, and do the exact same thing as I did a minute ago. And half time. And I'm going to make this four, and that four as well. So then that will sound a bit more, maybe you could do the attack actually as well. Back up a bit now we change that. What does it sound like if I do... No, I don't want to do that. So, yeah, as you can see, sometimes it can take a while to find the count really, but once you get it going... That's the calamity. That's pretty good. We could add maybe a third calamity. That's a lot um, high pitch. So we might be able to do it now quickly. Um, I'm going to do it on the same one. Maybe just bring up the one more so you can hear. Oops, look at that. All right, so. Maybe for the change up here we can go a bit more, a bit more like darker, a bit more aggressive. sound quite good. Oh my god. Alright, so
Cool, so that's basically it really. Um pattern split channel to do this and then you have the two um melodies. So that's it really. do with this is actually take this part play it twice and then for the next chorus of the beat or whatever it is we'll add the uh, the higher pitch later on so yeah I'm gonna actually make a beat to this real quick so if you're not interested in the beat you can click on the video now this is how you make a melody but yeah this is basically it it's quite it's quite simple you could even um, Reverse it. It probably could sound quite a good reverse. I don't think you can reverse in the half time, so I'm going to do it on here. Uh, reverse it. So, no, that sounds quite good. But um, yeah, you can do a lot of things over it. Really. You can do um, different effects, different stuff on it. I'm not going to go too into detail of it. I'd rather you go on your own and try and create your own sort of sound, not just copyright. But this is basically it, so I'm going to do the beat now and I'll come back to you when it's finished.